Agent Romanov. You miss me? Oh yeah, Charles. We got ourselves an X-Men fan. Captain. Yeah, Captain. Big fan. Spider-Man. Hey guys and welcome to Film Artsy, your number one source for all things films and movies. And we've been following the Spider-Man cast for quite some time with all of the rumored appearances that are jumping up and being announced. And it's looking like this new Spider-Man movie may actually be taking shape in a direction that no one really fully anticipated until more recently when these leaks started to come out in the first place. Now these potential talks actually are circling around the idea of possibly Sony finally getting the Sinister Six movie that they've wanted for years and years now. And interestingly enough, We've had rumors for quite some time of different casting decisions that Marvel and Sony were looking into for a while now, except now when we start to count how many villain characters we have filling in the spaces for this upcoming movie, we all of a sudden have a lineup that could potentially be that Sinister Six that Marvel has wanted for quite some time. Now besides the exciting news surrounding the fact we would be seeing old Spider-Man characters like Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire return into this movie in some form or another, we also have other rumors really saying that this story will continue to focus on Tom Holland's Spider-Man at the forefront and he still is the main character and this still is a Spider-Man 3 but this also could be kind of the start of a new trilogy line that would continue to use the plot points introduced in this growing Spider-Verse type timeline where we see these other characters and universes and villains from other timelines make their appearance. But look at the lineup that we're starting to have for the rumored villains that are going to appear in this movie. It's looking like it could potentially be a massive Sinister Six movie with all familiar actors and faces that we've seen in previous films throughout the Spider-Man series or series of films that have been made. Very obviously, there were the big rumors following the return of, of course, Alfred Molina as Dr. Octopus, which would be one villain taking on a role that could form into a larger six or sinister six in the film sense. But there were also rumors that have kind of popped up now in very recent news, linking actors like Thomas Hayden Church for Sandman from Spider-Man 3, Michael Keaton's Vulture, which was in Spider-Man Homecoming 1, William Defoe's Norman Osborn, and Dane DeHaan's Harry Osborn, which were both in separate timelines, with us having William Defoe's Norman Osborn in the very first Spider-Man movie with Tobey Maguire, and Dane DeHaan's Harry Osborn in The Amazing Spider-Man 2 with Andrew Garfield. So now we're looking at this list and a possible lineup of having four characters just there, plus the Doctor Octopus, and then we knew from way back we had Jamie Foxx talking about jumping on the role of Electro, and that one is almost confirmed by the studio for Spider-Man 3. So as these are very locked in rumors, the speculation of course spreads out to those other actors reprising their roles, but maybe we are seeing a full on Sinister Six type thing appear here and it could be really, really big. And we don't really know to the full extent which characters are going to fully be reprising their roles, or maybe we will see some more surprises like Jake Gyllenhaal, which was rumored to reprise his role as Mysterio. We don't fully have the biggest picture just yet, but we are likely going to see so many villains. We think that with the large lineup, it's going to be obviously the start of a larger story arc, but we may likely just have shorter appearances of these villains and not necessarily full on scenes or full on story arcs developing all these characters when the cast is already up to 13 or 14 major characters, all with important storylines. And then the amount of side characters that exist just in the regular Spider-Man Homecoming series, there definitely will be only so much time to really tell stories. So we do think a lot of these will just be really cool homages and one-off moments, but it'll be really awesome to see what they end up turning it into and what type of role we see more in the future and if this leaves the door open for even more exciting things down the road. But what do you think of the possible Sinister Six lineup? Let us know what you're thinking in the comments down below. Be sure to subscribe with notifications on for more videos like this uploaded every single day of the week. But that's it for today. We'll see you all next time with a brand new video. Yes.
I'm about to. Hi, everybody. Hey, everybody. How you doing? Hi. 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 <laughs> Mm -hmm. See you guys.